phone on. Hey, Anagret, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? Right now I'm in the car and uh, I'm going to Yenna. So I'll be in Yenna like at 16 o'clock. 16 o'clock? Yeah. Um, then it will take a train from Yenna to Valleford with Hopper ticket. I will write you by SMS for what's named. Cool. Um, today there is a like, small demonstration in Waldorf and I would like to go there. Okay. Uh, maybe that I stay in Valleford uh, for like half hour longer that I can pick you up and we go together to go north. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, okay. Okay. Okay, then see you later. Yeah? See you soon. Ciao, ciao. Okay, bye. Okay, just made it to Salfed. Now Woo! we're gonna go to Gondorf, right? Mm -hmm. For a demonstration. <laughs> so yeah, I put my bags in that locker there, number 12. Come get it later. Let's go. Often when you watch you see, when you see me, So, uh, you may be wondering why I didn't film much of the demonstration. Well, um, that's because uh, this demonstration was in a small town in the east of Germany. Where in this town there's a group of aggressive Nazis who actually try taking pictures of people who are against racism or who are pro-refugees who help refugees out in the centers and things like that. And then uh, they, once they have the picture, then they can find out like who the person is and where they live and try to figure out their schedule and once I have that then they go to a group and they and, and they hunt them down and if they catch them then they they beat them up so like the organizers kindly asked me not to film anything at the demonstration so that the footage can't get in the wrong hands to the Nazis if I put it online or something of people's faces and they can figure out where everybody's from and all that so that's totally understandable. I was like, no problem. I won't film anything of the, no faces on the demonstration. And actually, this demonstration was a solidarity demonstration for a teenage girl who got uh, caught by some Nazis and got beaten up like two weeks prior to this event. So yeah, this is a very real problem that, that small towns and villages have across Germany. And I'm very glad that I was there to show my solidarity and also to get educated on the issue because I had no idea that this was happening before and there's a big problem and yeah we gotta stand up against it and in this demonstration as well we actually uh, uh, marched past the bar where it's a hangout place for the Nazis in this town right now I found a fucking awesome hill to skate down Often wondered what you think when you think of me. Oh. Often wondered how we made you feel. Just we so close. Hey guys, we're now we just landed in a house, and what we're we gonna do tonight? We are doing some forbidden stuff, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> This is my cock, she's on my board. <laughs> Everything is shaved, nice and tidy. Not for everyone, but for you to watch on YouTube. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> you will know what we were talking about. Now one day we will ever a peace song. Did we come out strange girl to me? I don't know if we can see anything. Come on, follow me. Can we see anything? I think it's way too dark. Oh, where are we? Oh, no, it's just a little house. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, this is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> How many people are we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine people in a little, little house in a garden. Life has color. 
The life has colors. It's not only black and white. Why there are so many Ferraris coming out of the street? <laughs> We made it into yeah. Anagut's friend's house and he actually makes drums. It's really cool drums. Leute, ich kann euch nur einen Tipp geben. Meine Erfahrung sind, wenn ihr es da ganz entspannt seid, definitiv kein Stress macht. Kurz. So once again, uh, I was on another demonstration in the in the east of Germany and I was there visiting. This time in a city called uh, called Plauen, and there there was a, a a march organized by by some Nazis. So of course there was an anti demonstration organized by Antifa, and I didn't get much footage because of the same reasons as I mentioned before. So the official count was that the, the, there were 900 Nazis marching and in the anti-demonstration there was 1,200 but both demonstrations never clashed, they never met and uh, the demonstration I was at was relatively peaceful there was a few uh, scuffles with the police but nothing too severe <laughs> But I read some articles about the, the Nazi demonstration and apparently they were pretty aggressive like throwing rocks and, and trying to break through the police line and the police had to use tear gas, pepper spray and water cannons and all that. The police kept on stopping our demonstration and like we stopped maybe like five times or something but yeah it was it was peaceful and it was okay nothing too bad happened say hello <laughs> so today we, we we traveled to a close by uh, camp a refugee camp pretty nice one and we brought the slack line along first time they're doing slack lines and I think they're enjoying it they're really enjoying it Good. Is this? Hello. 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 Hello.
No We get this there. Good? Oh, it's good? Why you do it? Do that here. Eh? Da ba la la ba la. Aku ruru ruru nemu ni. Mana kasih kasih? Hello, hi. Where are we right now? Uh, right now what? in Sandberge in Remschitz. And so it's actually a pretty nice place. <laughs> Okay, so our goal is to get over there. There. Fun. And we're so close, but we're so far yeah. apart. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we're so close, but we're so far apart. So right now is my last day in Saddlefed, just next to the train station. And Alligator is gonna do something to my board. This is just like one strap, like. Yeah, do it. Oh no, the color is out! Really? <laughs> That's so funny. There's not more to make it more green. <laughs> anyway. It, was, it wasn't meant to be. No, there's a little green dot. It wasn't meant to be. <laughs> 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 